So here we are at the Port Weller Dry Docks in St. Catharines, Ontario, talking to Canada's shipbuilders. And I want to tell you, there is a lot of good things happening right here at the Heddle Shipyard. And such a privilege to be in conversation with those people that are building the ships and repairing the ships for our country. So, Brooke, why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself? Hi, uh, my name is Brooke Warren. I'm currently a Ocean and Naval Architectural Engineering student at Memorial University of Newfoundland, and I'm doing my uh, fifth co-op here at Heddle Shipyards. So Brooke, where are you from originally? Uh, I'm originally from a local town in Newfoundland called St. Anthony. Um, it's about 1,500 people population, and I moved to St. John's for school. Is it St. Anthony or St. Anthony? <laughs> Snanny. <laughs> <laughs> Brooke, so you left small town St. Anthony, which is a beautiful part of the world, beautiful part of Newfoundland, and you made your way into MUN. And now what you say you're at year five right now, yep. is this your final work term? This is my final work term. I'm graduating in May. So you graduate, and what will your degree be in? Uh, so my full degree, it's a Bachelor of Engineering, but specializing in Ocean and Naval Architectural Engineering. Wow, that's amazing. <laughs> yeah. And has that been something, a, a lifelong dream of yours, to do something like this? Or did you find your path as you went along? Um, I definitely, uh, I first, I went into my first year of MUN engineering kind of not knowing what type of engineering I wanted to go into. Um, but I have a family background in, within the marine industry, specifically fishing. Okay. Um, so essentially, I just, after my first year, I was kind of introduced to the Ocean and Naval Architectural Engineering Program at MUN, which is actually the... Um, only undergraduate program in that field in Canada and um, I just went for it and I've loved it ever since. Where's the family? Who's fishing in your family? Uh, it was basically my like my well my father used to fish and then my uncles and my grandfather. A lot of fishermen up there in St. Yeah. Anthony <laughs> yeah. and now here you are repairing and perhaps building ships of the future. Pretty exciting time Absolutely. at Heddle Shipyard. And not only that, but a pretty exciting time in shipbuilding in Canada. You must feel the excitement with everything that's going on. Yeah, absolutely. The whole, um, the national shipbuilding strategy has definitely uh, made a massive impact on my career. Uh, it's kind of secured my career for the next, <laughs> for all of my life, so yeah. that, that's super exciting. Brooke, <laughs> How does that feel to know that you're going to graduate with a very, very topical degree that can be applied immediately? And as you so rightly point out, there's 20 and 30 years of work here. It must feel absolutely amazing. It, it definitely feels reassuring uh, to know that I have a stable career because <laughs> yeah. uh, I've watched um, a lot of careers, you know, like for example, the oil industry, not, not so stable, but uh, this, it's, it's definitely reassuring. So as a work term student, and you've had, as you say, four other work terms, you would have a pretty good lens on HEDL. You, how was your experience with HEDL? Um, I've very much enjoyed myself so far. I'm kind of, I've, on my past work terms, I've spent time um, in the technical field. Uh, so this is my first time in the project management field, and I'm absolutely loving it. I've definitely found uh, my element and my niche here. So, right. so if Heddle picks up the call and says, "Hey, Brooke, come on back. Are you coming?" <laughs> we can talk about that later. <laughs> <laughs> I love your honesty. It's the best. Now, Brooke, I mean, a very exciting. It must feel good to be a part of this whole industry uh, with so much good things happening. But I, I want you to know that you should really take pride in the path that you've chosen and also the work that the people around you are doing because you're serving Canada right alongside those people that are serving on those vessels. Absolutely. That must feel great. It, it definitely feels great and it's like a sense of accomplishment. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Good for you, Brooke. Listen, it's been an absolute pleasure to be in conversation with you. Thank this you. This is what the face of Canadian shipbuilding looks like. It doesn't get any better than this. Small town, Newfoundland, right up on the northern peninsula, finds her way right here in the center of Canada between Buffalo and Toronto. The, the uh, Welland Canal right behind me. This young woman is making a difference to Canada and supporting our shipbuilding strategy right alongside Heddle Shipyard. What a great conversation. <laughs>